Hey, howdy, hey everybody, how's it going? This video is going to be kind of like a little behind the scenes video on my stop motion uh, shorts. I've been getting a lot of questions about how I go about doing these shorts. So I just thought I'd give you a little bit of kind of, like I said, behind the scenes. So let's go. So this, this is my workstation. Um, granted, we just finished the uh, winter lodge and I'm going to be <clears throat> fixing this area very soon. As you can see, it needs some love, but this video is more about the stop motions. Um, yeah, it's, it's a mess. So I have to, I gotta clean it up. Uh, storm, I just finished a little bit, a couple days ago. So we will put her back in. We are gonna be working on Luke Skywalker. Uh, this one is the, um, from the Land Speeder. And uh, yeah, we're gonna do some little quick, a quick little video on him. First thing we're gonna do is we are going to take everything apart. Even the lightsaber, put it off to the side. The binoculars, same thing. Head, body, and we're gonna start with the legs. Now on the bottom of the legs, some people like to use that uh, tack, that sticky tack. I like to use double-sided tape. It leaves a smaller footprint <clears throat> and uh, you know, I just feel that it uh, makes editing a lot a lot quicker. Um, I know some people don't edit that state that tack out, uh, and I feel like that hurts some uh, stop motion videos. Um, at least in my view, that's all I see on some stop motion videos is that sticky tack. So once you put the double-sided tape on the bottom of the feet you can put it down and then you can reapply as many times as you want and then we just begin the process of having Luke walk with his feet first and as you can see so what I've been doing is doing a half a step and then bringing the leg up And then moving them down like that. But then you have to remember this part here, you gotta bring that back up because the body stays upright. And there you go. Continue that for a few more times until you get to the middle. So what I'm using is my Canon EOS R5. It's a mirrorless camera. And then what I do is I lo upload the photos onto my computer in Lightroom because I process them in RAW. You don't have to process them in RAW. Uh, I do that only because I am a photographer and I don't like to change from RAW to JPEG. And then I might happen to forget when I'm out on a shoot to change it back over from JPEG to RAW. So I just leave it in RAW. But you can change it if you want to. You can leave it in the, into the RAW format or into the JPEG format. And then I process it. Once it's into the JPEG format, I process it through um, DaVinci Resolve and I upload the short. So I like to actually make some kind of a story for each mini minifigure. Uh, I don't like to just build it and then show it off. I like to have them do something in the, the five to eight seconds of each, each build. So that's my, my thing. 
Um, if you want to just show it off, just uh, build it and say, hey, this is what the minifigure looks like. Go for it. That's what you do. Um, but this is kind of like just like the very beginning of what stop motion is all about. Hopefully I can get into some more story making that that's into the future. I would love to do some kind of a story in the Winter Village. That would be really cool. But yeah, we're going to keep going with the, with the Luke Skywalker build here. So now that we got Luke Skywalker's legs to the middle part of the camera, we're going to start turning him so that he's facing the camera. And then we're going to build him. So what you want to do at this point, or what I do at this point is, I reapply tape because and and so what you do is i've been taking this little jumper and kind of marking where the feet are this way you can easily have a reference for when you need to put it back put the figure back in front of the camera and uh it doesn't look like it's jumped all over the place so now that we got Luke Skywalker's legs there, we're going to take a picture of that. And then what we're going to do is we'll take the torso and put it down just like so. And just put it right on the top of the legs like that. Take the picture and then just kind of slide it down just a little bit, a little bit more. I'm going to move his hand down a little bit. And then we're going to close the gap there and move his hand down a little bit more. Now this Luke does have two faces on it. So we will use this face first. Actually, you know we're gonna use the sad face first. So we're gonna start there. Pop it down just a little bit more. There you go. And then we're gonna put the hair on. And now that all of the little details have been done, it's time to walk Luke off stage and the short is complete. So that is basically a behind the scenes video on how I make my shorts. If you have any questions at all on the build, on the process, on anything, let me know. Uh, Cause I would gladly go over the stop motion with you that I, that I do. If you enjoy the stop motion content or any of my content, hit the like and subscribe button because it helps us out. Uh, but once again, thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. And we'll talk to you guys on the next one. You guys have a great night.